Hmm, something happened about this in your cut. My voice, what do you think? Is better? <laughs> finally, finally, I am without my heart talking to that. Hi guys, I'm Fabrizio and welcome to my YouTube channel. Oh, what do you think about my haircut? Finally, for after four months, I'm so happy. Today, yeah, first of all, this is the month of Be Authentic. And today my topic is about how to make uncomfortable decisions. Yes. Let's talk about that. Oh, as I said, let's talk about that. Hmm, something happened about this in your cut. My voice, what do you think? Is better? But let's go back about uncomfortable decisions. I already talked about that in my last uh, talks. But today, I want to talk about that because in the UK, we are out of the lockdown. The Finally, we are, I'm so happy about that. Finally, I met some friends. I'm going to see some friends during the weekend. We can go out, we can have some drinks. That's where people are feel a bit um, afraid. What I've noticed in the last few days is that people, they don't know really where to find the, the right motivation and especially how to start. And I want to give you, all of you, wherever you are in the world, that you can be millions and millions and millions one day that um, let's start making uncomfortable decisions what is the difference with the comfortable decision and uncomfortable decision comfortable the decision in my case would be let's talk about me i would be okay four years ago four years ago before um, when i was in italy and i was feeling better i could still live there i could find a job in my in my small village and i could live there and it's all man i would find probably a guy i hope so and my life would be like that but I, first of all it was not the right decision for me it was not for fabio so then i made a comfortable decision i was 33 years old so i'm going back to london i'm going to open my own business and after i became a speaker so that um, would have been was the thing <laughs> that would be the impossible when the impossible became the possible remember that impossible possible impossible possible so I come, I moved back to London and so many things happened. I made so many decisions because I remember we, all day we make a decision. All day from the moment that we wake up. And it's all about you. What kind of decision you want to make? And I'm a big fan of uncomfortable decision because uncomfortable decision goes in the direction of growth. You will become a better person. You will become a person where some one day you will achieve goals. But let's go back about this uncomfortable meaning. What, what is that? Most of the time when I mentor people as well, it's really interesting because when I, mentor, I was mentoring a girl uh, two weeks ago about how she was doing this really important pitch for a company, and I said, let's talk the story behind that. What made you, what made you decide to do this product? To be, let's um, make the people interested about your, uh, your product, I was saying to her. Because she was saying all about the product without emotion. Let's talk about how difficult it was for you because we want to we connect with the difficulties. difficulties. Uncomfortable as well is about courage. It is an act of courage. Yes. And I said, we need that, especially in this moment that we can feel a bit afraid. We don't know. People think that because only because we went out of the lockdown, we all feel again with all the energy. Oh, wow, let's do that. Ba, 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 ba. No, doesn't go like that. Because this is the moment where the difficulties can come. So I'm going to give you three things to do it. The first one is about to the, a goal for this first month. Something that you can write on a piece of paper, say, this month I'm going to do that. This, this is my goal. Three months, six months. And if you can write on the comments your three big, three goals, 
that would be great because I can check you and we can talk about that. And this thing, this is, and I hope that they're going to make you a bit feel a bit worried. But I always say, and when I make, when I made a really uncomfortable decision that I'm going to show you next month about my business, I'm going to do something that really I want to leave you with really dot 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 but uh, it's really uncomfortable and i don't know what can happen but this is life what does mean life uh, i yesterday i finished i was in a, i was doing a motivation talk what does it mean life it, and ask to yourself because right now after this pandemic uh, what we all learn that at the end of the day life is can be like something like that don't think that I'm crazy because I am a bit. I am a bit. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> I'm a bit. I'm all of that. But uh, if you will think about this pandemic, what what is the learning process that you had? Do what you want to do it. Make a comfortable decision, and I promise you, you will become a great person. You will become a person full of uh, ideas, and you will have success. Success, success, that you, oh my god, with my success. So remember that uncomfortable decision, you become an amazing person. Uncomfortable decision, great person. Uncomfortable decision, successful person. Hope that you enjoyed about my talk about making uncomfortable decision. I repeat it so many times. And remember, be true to you. And let me know if you like my new haircut. Okay. Bye-bye.